Hi, JP here again, and welcome to the third part of uh, my journey into the world of jazz harmony video series. In the last video, we learned that we get uh, Barry Harris uh, major six D minor and Barry Harris minor six D minor scales for uh, C uh, from C's overtones and undertones. But also uh, we found uh, uh, found there uh, Barry Harris dominant D minor C dominant D minor scale also. So when we learn that we got uh, these D minor triads uh, from uh, overtones, uh, then we. There is a D minor set. This is <laughs> this is major triad. Okay, uh, D minor set triad. Uh, we got C seven, G seven, and E seven. And these three chords come uh, when we think that uh, this C is uh, fundamental, but also when this G is uh, fundamental and this uh, E is fundamental on the C major chord. Barry Harris C dominant D minor set scale, which I also called uh, C Stogilic, which name come from Ian Rink's excellent uh, uh, the universe the 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 exciting universe of music theory, which I highly recommend to check out. Uh, it goes like this. So it's a like a, uh, it's like bebop dominant scale, but it has this flatten uh, flatten thirteenth. And also we can think that this is a, a combination of two scales, which are C harmonic uh, major. And uh, C uh, melodic major. This melodic major is the uh, same as uh, F melodic minor. So now we got to tonic C, uh, C7, C6, and C minor 6. And to, to second degree, we got. Uh, D minor set as like a 7 degree, flat 6 degree, and 4 degree. And if we put all these notes together, we got a scale named C mixed major and minor scale, which goes like this. This scale has linked to the negative harmony, but the negative, negative harmony is so big a topic that it needs own video, uh, and maybe I'll make someday that uh, video also. And now we got all Barry Harris D minor set scales except one, and uh, this is. Uh, Barry Harris dominant 7 flat 5 D minor set scale. So it's a C dominant 7 flat 5 D minor set scale. And we one way to get it uh, is to manipulate this Stogilic scale. For, and uh, there, there have it uh, this G, which is a fifth, and we want to uh, flat fifth, so we uh, flatten that uh, to the G uh, flat. And it goes like this. This scale also has another name, and this is a Messian mode 6. Uh, this Messian uh, come from uh, a composer 
uh, and organ player Oliver Messian. And uh, this scale uh, is, uh, he has seven uh, Messian modes, which all are uh, symmetrical. But this is also an other topic <laughs> and also uh, have to have own video uh, that someday maybe I made it make a video about messian modes. And now back to business. So we got this C6, C minor 6, C7 and C7 flat 5. And if we put all these uh, notes together, we got Hungarian major scale. So it goes like this. So all these four scales have the same diminished chord. And, and as you like this diminished uh, chord uh, goes uh, like in minor thirds. And if we think that also these, these chords go to minor thirds. And put for example all uh, these C7 chord, uh, chords together we got this scale. So it's an octatonic scale. And you, if we put all uh, six chords to, together, we got this scale. So it's an octatonic scale also. And same happened if we put this all uh, minor six scale uh, chords together, we got also. And of course, if we put this all uh, seven flat five uh, together, we get got also the same scale. And if we put only two chords together, for example this C7 and F sub 7, which is Triton away, uh, we got different scale. This scale names Triton scale and uh, also if we put this C7 and A7, we got also different scale. And only uh, chord uh, with uh, triton is the same it's a uh, seven flat five of course it's not only where it's uh, four uh, different uh, different notes and now you might be wonder what to do all these scales okay this is a different story <laughs> but uh, we can uh, put these uh, uh, scales, these Barry Harry scales, uh, in uh, uh, different uh, functions. So, for example, this uh, uh, C6, we can, for example, uh, make it uh, B flat 6 diminished. And this. Uh, Minor sticks we can put uh, in second degree. Barry Harris uh, called that uh, it's a uh, important minor, and this important means that it's a uh, part of uh, seven. Uh, and now we can also think that this seven. Uh, D minus scale go to uh, f five uh, 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 degree, and also we can think uh, an other uh, seven chord, which goes uh, to five of this two chord. So and now this connection to this B flat because it's a G, C, it's a, this minor third, and they have both same D minor chord. And now you know this uh, code to uh, 
uh, this scale code to C minor. And then this C minor go to D7, and this D7 uh, go to again uh, B flat. And we uh, for that uh, F7 we can uh, use bebop dominant scale because it has this major third but also we can uh, put uh, also we can uh, use f6 so it's a f6 diminished and f7 diminished scale so now it's a uh, nine tone scale but uh, not may uh, maybe not in a row but uh, in uh, like riffs and of course now we can put this seven flat five uh, course also for this g G7 flat 5 is also D flat 7 flat 5. F7 uh, flat 5 is also B7 flat 5. And now we got this, uh, also this D minus set for these chords. But if we put these together only, we got whole tone scale. And now if we put one D minus set chord, to this whole tone scale and this diminished chord, uh, chord uh, is uh, from uh, for example this F7 flat 5 then we cut also Messia mode 6 <laughs> and uh, but this is a, a different ro rotation of that scale and of course we, if we put this uh, diminished scale from this and other uh, and other uh, scale uh, uh, and other flat five, so it, it's uh, from this G, so it's a, then uh, F sub, and the same uh, whole tone scale. We can also and other uh, Messia mode six rotation. But if we put only these two D minor scale together, we got D minor scale. And this D minus scale, what we got this uh, E D minus and F sub D minus which come from uh, this G seven flat five and this F seven flat five uh, is uh, same scale uh, what we got when we start from this uh, C, so it's a C octatonic, but when we start from uh, E, it's a E D minus scale and it goes like this. And now we want one more function, and this is a four degree. And uh, for four degree, uh, we got this uh, E flat six, but also E flat minor six chord. So now we have two minor six chords from uh, second degree and uh, four degree. Uh, and then we got these two seven chords for five and uh, six degree uh, but also we got this uh, c6 chord for first degree and of course fifth degree and then also this fourth degree so all these degrees have this chord and also, of course, we got this seven uh, for uh, first degree, seven flat for uh, first degree, and of course, minor six. Uh, and same is a situation for this F7. So we got F7 flat 5, of course, 
this is uh, already uh, and but also uh, uh, six uh, mi minor six F minor six so now we got all chords almost to all uh, these degrees uh, for this second degree we also many times uh, got this seven uh, a seven flat file uh, so there is a lot of uh, different uh, pots functions where you can put these chords or scales and of course there's a so messy thing there's a so many things but if you uh, just start to play and think what you want to play uh, i mean if you want to play some uh, minor minor thing or if you want to play uh, some uh, one six two five rhythm changes thing or blues thing and uh, check uh, something from these scales and try to connect them because there is a lot of connections and if you just try to uh, start to use them you notice them uh, and uh, learn how to use them So now uh, I start to this uh, second degree and I think uh, that I play for that second degree. Uh, so how I think, I think that there is a uh, two and uh, when it's second degree is in my mind, it's a, like a tonic. <laughs> Or even it's a second degree and it has own uh, seven so this is a something and now I'm uh, here in F seven A do 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 and now I go to C minor C minor six or C minor I think and then D F seven and then B flat. And now it's the time end of this video. So if you like it, please click thumbs up. And if you are not my subscriber yet, please subscribe my channel. The next harmony video uh, goes to uh, George Russell's Lydian chromatic concept. Or it's not exactly George Russell's uh, concept because I have uh, my own version of that, but uh, we uh, also talk about this uh, George Russell's uh, concept. So see you in next video and bye.